Hey, what's up, you guys? This is the latest thing I've been working on, and uh, so far it turned out pretty good. Um, it's a pretty big cabinet that uh, we just had sitting in our garage, and uh, I just decided to do something with it. So it's just a simple melamine cabinet, nothing special. Uh, the bottom is messed up quite a bit, but um, we're going to fix that with some 2x4s and stuff. So, yeah, it'll be all fancy. Um, it's not fully finished yet. I still have to install some uh, ceramic lights up in the tops of each one. Uh, so, that'll be pretty difficult. But anyways, um, it should be pretty fun. <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to get a good view of it. Uh, so what I did is I took just some regular Great Stuff expanding foam, gaps and cracks, and I just filled the whole back wall with it on every single one of them, except for the bottom one, because that one's going to be for supplies. And uh, then I just took some bark that was from an old dead tree that fell down. Um, I let it soak in the sun for a few days, then I put it on there. Um, have lots of bark in there just to make it not fully foam and I have a piece of bark here that just comes out into the abyss and then I have some rock tile that I broke and uh, put it in here uh, just put it with the expanding foam and then on some parts that I thought were necessary to cover up and stuff I did another uh, thing of expanding foam when all of this was dry and put some, uh, what is it, sphagnum moss. Uh, so, sphagnum moss, you just like get a big handful and put it on the wet uh, expanding foam and it sticks and it looks pretty good. Um, but while the foam was drying the first time, I took some eco earth, some uh, excavator substrate, and crushed English walnut shells and sprinkled on top of it and it stuck. So, yeah, that's what I did with all of them. And they all turned out pretty nice. Um, again, I'm not done. I've still got to add uh, the water dish, which will be just a regular um, tub and I'll put expanding foam around it so the tub will be removable but you won't be able to really tell it's um, a tub like it'll you'll just have to wait for the second part <laughs> second part um, mixed up it's dark outside I don't like the dark just kidding maybe um, yeah it turned out pretty nice um, the lights I'll show you them in the second part and um, everything's going good. Uh, for the front of it, I'm going to get some uh, different things of window screen, which is just this stuff. Try to, yeah, it's just this stuff. Oh, do you like my bracelet? Winning. Yeah. Uh, anyways, yeah, I'm going to put that on the top, and then I'll have it so it swivels out like a book. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty excited. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it for something, because it would be pretty good for geckos and tree frogs and stuff. Um, or I might sell it at an expo. I haven't really made up my mind yet, but it's pretty awesome. Maybe for some crested geckos if I ever get into them. But yeah, thanks for watching, and um, have a good day. I like going up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Side to side, side to side.